if you're tired of jittery, inconsistent AI videos, then Pusa might be your new best friend. This powerful add-on boosts motion quality and temporal coherence and plug right into models like WAN, text video and other things. So now let's get into this GitHub page. This is the main Pusa's GitHub page. As you can see, they, they have launched yesterday and it's it's faster and use a lot less less steps for image to video for van so this might be better so as you can see standard image to generation model rather zero shot multiple capability such as start to end frame video extension everything can be done with pusa and this only cost 0.1k to make that but we'll this is open source so we'll get it for free so as you can see these are few examples that they have given i'll share the link with you guys in my patreon page if you haven't followed followed me over there become a member it's for free so as you can see this is start to end frame we can you start to end frame as well. So Pusa is a motion adapter. It's not a full model on its own. Instead of replacing a base video model, it just enhances it. Think of it as a plugin for your van 2.1. Okay. And in this workflow, we are going to use light X2V, which will, which will produce mm, in four steps. Okay, so now let's go to Comfy UI and see the workflow. So here it is, as you can see. To and van video model, we'll take the same thing. For Pusa, we'll use this. So I'll give the link in the description. This Pusa was made by Kajai, and I'll give the link down below for the LoRa of our Hugging Face website. Okay. Now, as you can see, I have also included Light X2V in this. This is the 14B version. Everything is the 14B version. This is the model that we are going to take. And the height and the width is 720 by 720. Okay. So, as you can see, so this frames is 81 for right now we want to change it and extend it okay so oh, let me just close this so now let's see the prompt a young woman drinks coffee normally basic command and i'm going to use four steps cfg should be one and shift s5 and the new scheduler as you can see flow match pusa okay so this is the video that we got looks pretty pretty good so i'm running this on running up uh, this is rdf 40 handy with 24 gb of vram and it took around 20 to 30 seconds okay so I have included this purge VRAM as well to get low VRAM or not get any errors. Okay. So I have also connected an answer video to enhance the video a little bit. So now let's take this video, uh, this photo. It's the same. Uh, now let's see the prompt. The girl moves her head towards the mountain and starts to walk forward. So as you can see, the mountains are in front of her. I need the girl to... Okay. As you can see in the video, it works perfectly. Okay. Now, Pusa is a little better with motions. So we're going to first save this file. And we're going to change the frame rate to 24. Okay. So 
let's take the same photo, same text and everything. Now I change it to 24. In this video, was 24 frames. And as you can see, this is much better. Uh, as you can see, the footsteps of the sand are also very realistic. As you can see, see. So this model, the LoRa, is very good with motion adapter and a hair that was uh, weaving was also very realistic and motion helped a lot. So now let's take this photo of a dog uh, which didn't load in the running hub and same 81. The dog is walking towards the camera and that starts licking his leg. So this was the prompt and this is what we got. So as you can see, this is much better for the motion. As you can see, the motion of the dog is also very good. This is also 24 frames per second. So because we've used 24 frames per second, we're going to use 1, 10, 120 frames to get the video to 3 to 5 seconds. But I've lowered the width and the height because that was giving me errors because of the low VRAM. Okay. Everything else is the same. As you can see right here, the number of steps is also the same. If you want to enhance a little bit, you can do six steps. Okay. So that would be a little bit better, but not by that much. So as you can see, this looks very realistic. So now let's try another thing. So this is the prom that we are going to take walking in the field. So as you can see, the chain is there. The only bad part is that the dog's leg went through the human's leg, as you can see right over here. This is the only bad part that I noticed. Okay. So, let's end this video right over here. If you guys do like this video, then please do like, comment and subscribe to my channel. And become a member for my Patreon page. It's absolutely free. If you want to pay, you can pay for the membership. You will get a little bit perks. But instead of that, it's absolutely free. And if you want to use Running Hub, you can use it. Uh, I'll give the link in the description. You'll get 1000 free points and you could make at least 100 videos with it. Okay. So like, comment, and subscribe to my channel.